Sup guys over of here. In this video we're going to be talking about Cybertrack event from CyberConnect, also previously known as Cyber Voyage. As usual, links are going to be in the description, but follow them at your own risk. This event already started and it's going to go on for roughly two months, going to end on September 24th. As for rewards, it's been announced 1.8 million uh, USD, although probably we're not going to get it in the form of actual stables. Plus, potentially we can be eligible for the CyberConnect airdrop, which is quite likely to happen, in my personal opinion. Now, regarding requirements, first of all, your wallet must be whitelisted. There are several prerequisites for that. However, based on information that I'm seeing currently, everybody can participate. Basically, all the wallets are whitelisted. Some people think that this is due to an error and it's going to be fixed later. So in case your wallet shouldn't be whitelisted, but you're still whitelisted now, probably better to swoop in while you can do that. And the second requirement to participate, you will need to transfer some tokens uh, equivalent of 10 USD. These tokens can be transferred for your cyber account. You won't be able to transfer it back if you change your mind. This is basically to pay the gas throughout the campaign. Also, you can read more about the event in this article. And just what I talked about, as you can see here, what this criteria is collectors of this announcement. This was a V3 announcement, but that was minted out. I didn't mean that. Then link three fan club user level five or above. I have haven't used this program and also top users from each mini track featured project and I'm not one of these also however if I go to Cybertrack I've already connected my MetaMask and as you can see it says congratulations you are on the whitelist also regarding cyber account it says by minting a cyber connect v3 evangelist nft this is the nft you mint that to start your journey basically the cyber account will be automatically created for you. Then you need to add at least 10 USD worth of funds to be eligible for rewards. You can do that via multiple blockchains. They can only be used for gas and they are not refundable. This is basically what we touched on. So again, more details here. Let's actually go and try to complete something. So after we connect the wallet and if you're whitelisted, the first thing to do is we need to sign here. So this one is being minted on Polygon. You don't pay any gas here. Gas is being covered uh, by Link3 here. And this transaction is two in one transaction. You create in your cyber account and you're also getting this NFT. Step number two, we need to top up the wallet. And we also need to confirm that we understand what we're doing and we are not completely stupid. Currently for the top up we have Polygon, Linea and BNB. I recommend using Polygon as the gas fees gonna be the lowest here probably. I'm just gonna do 15 medic. Basically the equivalent in USDs should be higher than 10. As you can see gas is like 1.5 cents. Okay, step number three, use gas credit on any network. And it states with a cyber account, use your gas credit on one blockchain to complete transactions on another. Claim cyber wallet early access NFT by minting it on a blockchain of your choice. Preferably different from the network you gas credit it is on. Note how you don't need to switch networks or need the native currency for your selected blockchain. Hi, it's only Polygon and Linea. I wanted to do it on different chain, but these are not available currently, so I'm just going to do it on Polygon. Okay, now we can go to the rewards tab. First of all, we can claim two mini shards. I saw in one article they saying that the value of one mini shard is 6 USD, but I don't know what it's based on. You can probably find more information on the recent CyberConnect articles. Not loading transaction fee. Okay, it says claim success. 
Then we can enter the raffle. Also, we need to share on Twitter. What's weird, I don't remember linking Twitter. Huh, wait, hold on. Ah, you need the Twitter URL. So it's not checking the actual account, it's just checking the tweet URL. Okay. Just need to copy that. Nice. And then we join, successfully join the raffle. And the last one here is early access to Cyber Wallet. For that, we need to have early access NFT that we already minted, and then we need to link email on link three. And while you're here, you may as well connect your Twitter and the Discord. But for now, you just need to link the email. Okay, that is linked. Now we can go back and refresh the page. And now we can sign up, successfully signed up. Okay, so that's currently what we can do on the Cybertrack. Uh, the next task should be on, I believe, in two weeks. Well, a bit less than two weeks now, but every two weeks we should have the new tasks. However, there are a couple additional steps here that you can do. First of all, you can go ahead and meet this announcement. Well, collect basically uh, this on BNB chain, mint this article um, as an NFT. So currently for me, five cents. And additionally, on link three, if you have the CyberConnect fan pass, you can participate in the ongoing raffle. That's going to end on August 3rd. Um, I'm not entirely sure how all of this works. As I said, I'm quite new to the link three platform, but I do have dot cyber profile. Yeah, I'm uh, able to claim fan pass. This is also a mint. Okay, so I claimed that. And so here, as far as I understand, you need 500 fan points uh, for every ticket that you want to get. And here we have different social activities that you can do and collect uh, some points. Also, I noticed that there are two pools here main pool and then side pool and in order to be eligible to get into the main pool you need to have your credit score of 25 plus in the gitcoin or hold a thousand plus event vest and these are basically i assume rewards from participating in various events on this platform if you're interested on that topic you have to research more yourself because this video is about cybertrack not link 3 platform but it's always nice to stumble upon interesting things. That's all I wanted to cover in this video. Thank you very much for watching. If you have any questions, comments, be sure to drop them down below. If you found video helpful, don't forget to like and subscribe. And I'll see you next time.